Okay, so you might be interested in adding one of these QR codes to something that you created in Canva because they're really cool for if I have a flyer hanging up on a bulletin board um, and I want people to remember my address, they can scan it in their phone and it'll take them right to my website where there might be the same information on the flyer or there might be added information on the flyer. It can take you to a whole lot of different things. They can lead you to images. They could lead you to just text. They can lead you to a web page. So you might be ad interested in adding one of these to your Canva docu document. I have a remove image background because I might want to remove the white, um, but I'm not going to for this demonstration. Just kind of keep in mind that I can remove the white background from the QR code as well. So I did a Google search for QR code generator and I'm just gonna click on this first one. Interested in doing something for free, but it kind of walks you through how to use this. So in this case, it says enter your website, text or drop a file, or you can see like there's so many different things. I can um, have an image gallery. I can connect to a Facebook page, PDF. So all of the QR code generators that are out there have so much power to them, but it does take time to explore. I just want my QR code to link to like my Facebook page or a website that I have. So I'm gonna quick go to um, my website and I copied it even before it came up and I'm going to go to the QR code generator and paste it in there and it's working on generating the code. And if you scan down here, you could see what it kind of looks like. You can see that you can change the shape and the color. You can add a logo. But some of these things you have to sign up for. And I'm not interested in that. I just want a free QR code, which will take a couple minutes to generate. So you can see that it's generating. And when it does, it'll come down here in the taskbar. And I can close out of here in the meantime. So there it is. My my, It's called frame, um, but there's my QR code. So now I want to go to my business card. So if I have a business card laying someplace and I want people don't want to have the whole business card, um, they might just want to um, be able to scan in the QR code. So here's how you use them. I like putting them in frames. That's just me. it doesn't matter you want to kind of I wouldn't use something like this because this uses two images I'm just going to use something like that might get close to a square as possible because it is kind of square shaped and I'm also going to upload it which I previously did and then I can drag it into that frame and the size of it doesn't matter I can resize it and it works at whatever size and then from when I get the size the way I want it I can place it and then it's on my um, it's on my business card. I can put it on a flyer. You can even uh, link a QR code to text. I've done a scavenger hunt that way. So um, one QR code leads to another QR code that gives me directions to something else. So QR codes are fun. They're great to add in Canva documents. Keep in mind you can remove the background from it so you don't have that white background and make it blend in a little bit. Um, but it's fun to add a QR code to your documents. It's very helpful, not on everything, but it does help on flyers. It helps on some, things like a, um, a business card. That's a little bit on QR codes.